four. It's day three of my Paris trip, and I believe day five of my Europe trip. So uh, yesterday I wasn't feeling too well, and I haven't been feeling that well this whole trip, to be honest. Especially like with eating. So I decided to take it easy yesterday. So I just woke up when I wanted to wake up today. I didn't really have any reservations except for dinner tonight. I'm gonna be going to the Eiffel Tower area and take some pictures. I'm going to uh, Le Entrecote, which is famous for their steak with green salt. That's one of the best steaks I've ever had. It's very soft and tender. And the sauce almost tastes kind of like a like an Indian curry almost. I don't really know how to explain it, but it doesn't taste like some oil, some spices. Yeah, it kind of tastes like curry. I fries are also really good too. It's very, very crisp and crunchy. I would say this is probably my favorite meal so far in Paris. The sauce is very interesting. It's very garlicky and oily and kind of resembles like chimichurri, but also kind of tastes curry-like, so it's very unique.
in the morning to do a photo shoot at the Louvre and Eiffel Tower with my amazing photographer of the day, Tika Shani. So be sure to book with her on Airbnb Experience for your own photo shoot. I'll put the link below and you can see the pics on my Instagram soon. local favorite to many in Paris and it's usually hard to get into but I keep here because of one of my favorite foodies Action Bronson he came here in his Paris video and I just have to point out whenever the menu is handwritten you know the food is very fresh and it definitely was Very um, refreshing and um, really fresh. All the food here was refreshing with unique flavors and had the right kind of balance between flavors and spices. And although I had some problems with eating during my trip, I had no problem finishing everything here. It was just that good. So I visited Officine Universelle Bouli, which is a well-known beauty shop from 1803. It's famous for their perfumes and natural products. And what makes their shop unique is that it's a perfume store and also a cafe that has a coffee bar on the side. I bought a face balm and a lip balm from them and I really liked it. Alright, it is day four being in Paris and day six being in Europe. So. A lot of fun, super tired, gonna head out to the Marais and go thrift shopping and I plan to walk along the Seine, uh, go to Maxime's for lunch and just have some fun today. soft and the, the mashed potato is very creamy and oh, so good. Best mashed potato. The chicken is very tender and soft too. It's all very like very tender and nice. The sauce is the sauce really pairs well with the chicken and the mashed potato. It's all very good. desserts I've ever eaten ever in my life. So good.
video as I take you on a tour and eat some of the best croissants in Paris. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.